I think it's important to say that there aren't different rules of the game in the subatomic world and the world that we observe. And, and it's pretty well understood, I would say it's well understood, how the, the, the world that we see emerges from this rather strange but well-defined uh, behavior that we, we see in the subatomic world. Now, we have an increasing number of quantum technologies that are really based on this behavior, the quantum computers being a good example. And so you see that this is not just something that you can say, well, we don't need to think about it really because it's in the world of atoms and it's all a bit whatever, and we, but, <laughs> and we can just do some calculations because we're using that behavior now in technologies. And so, so it really does become a, an important theory to try to, to understand.